Hey, I'm playing Chelsea Dagger by the Fratelli Street from the chord charts of the Morristown Uke Jam. So take the link in the video description, get the chord chart, and you can play along with me. Or, if you're going to be near Morristown, New Jersey, come play along with us in person. After the song, I'll do a basic tutorial. Here goes. Fratelli's indie Scottish rock band. Um, I started out the uh, the huh. okay the the strum on this starts out uh, with the intro just on the on the bass. If you have a low G, it would be even better. I don't, I'm not playing my low G here, but starts out just with the beat. Um. Notice I'm using my left hand to mute it, so it stops. Right? If I didn't, it would, it would sound like this. Right? But instead, it's... You can get it to stop by muting it with your left hand. Just pick up the pressure. And it has a short stay instead. And then uh, we go into the dodos. By the way, there are two versions of this... Uh, chord chart on the site. There's a simpler one and a, and a harder one. The simpler one just stays right on B, D. Right? And then switches to A. And just stays on an A. But if you want, you can play around with the, uh, the A string, your first string here, and make it sound better like this. Right? All I'm doing is switching 
from the first or from from these three strings to all four strings, right? I'm 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 dropping it on the second now. I I did something that's not written on the chord chart too. I ended up using the uh, the fifth fret on the A string in one spot. I'll show you. So the simplest way is like this. I'm still muting that that's an important part of, of the sound but now I'm gonna play with the the a string on the second fret watch same with the a adds a lot of personality right now I'm gonna use the second and the fifth frets Whatever level you like and you can play them complementary with two other people who are playing the other two kinds they all fit together it sounds great you can start with the easiest one and then you know after a month you get bored you can add the harder one it's it's okay you can do it that way what else did I do uh, the only other funny thing really uh, to say although in the the harder version I have higher levels of a bunch of I mean, you know higher up the spread of, of a bunch of common chords that are Easy chords on the lower, I mean, you know, like here's an F sharp minor, and I was doing it here, right? But it sounds better, so you can work on your way, you know, you can work your way up to that. But the the final bridge, you know, that's a little different when it goes, Chelsea, Chelsea, I believe on you, Benson, right? I just want to show that by sliding my hand, it's not as hard as it might seem. I mean, yes, I'm using higher up uh, versions, you know, I could have gone, Chelsea, Chelsea. Right, that's G A, but it sounds better if it climbs. So here's how I'm doing it. I'm doing a closed G. Chelsea, Chelsea, I. Here's my closed G. Okay, closed meaning it's not just these three. I'm I'm putting a finger down on this too. So right, so it's kind of barring it. I believe. Now the A is just slid up two frets. That's it. Chelsea, Chelsea, I believe when you're dancing slowly, stuck in your sleeve. I have no idea what that means, by the way. Suck in your sleeve? Why does she slow? I don't know. You boys get lonely after you leave. It's one for the dagger and another for the one you believe. Another advantage of going up like that, then you can change it when you go to the end of that. One for the dagger and another for the one you believe. It's a lower chord. It's actually still just a G and an A, but it sounds different because you're not playing it as high. You're, you're playing a little lower. It allows you more uh, more variety that way. That's it. Now I'm going to play through the dodos and one verse and then the chorus very slowly if you want to follow along with me. And again, you can follow along with the easiest with the, you know, including the second fret. You can follow along playing it exactly as I am, however you like. I'm going to play it slowly so that you can follow along and get the tour transitions. Uh, for the rest of you, subscribe if you want to see more of this. Check out the Morristown Youth Jam webpage for more song sheets, and I hope I see you some Wednesday. Goodbye. Now, very slowly, I'm just going to do the dodos. One verse, one chorus. Here goes. Oh, you must be a girl.
That's it. See you some Wednesday.